What is going on everyone? Today I'm going to be showing you hands down the best Premiere and After Effects plugin for color grading and achieving the cinematic look. Uh, this is a film stock emulator called Film Convert Pro. You can get it for around $90, but at the end of this video I'm going to be giving away two free copies of this, so watch until the very end for de details because the winner will be announced on Saturday, February 25th. Also, I don't have a lot of subs, so your chances of winning this are very high, so make sure you give the video a thumbs up if you want more giveaways like this. Okay. Okay, so once you've downloaded your program, you're going to want to go over to this effects tab right here, and you're going to want to look up Film Convert Pro. Uh, once you find that, just take that, drag it onto your clip. And it's great that this is a preset effect because not only can you use the sliders to change what the clip looks like, but you can also come over here and copy it and you can paste the attributes onto another clip and then it can select and do the... Okay, so once you've applied the effect, go over to the effect controls tab right here and then you're going to want to come down here until you find this little Film Convert Pro Film Stock Emulation uh, preset add-on. And the first thing that you're going to want to do from here is click your, click your source camera and you're going to want to pick your picture profile, uh, whatever uh, camera you use you can also go on their website and download more of them but um this doesn't technically mean that you have to use whatever camera this was shot on you can pretty much just click and find whatever you like um, the best uh, for drone shots I like Canon other Technicolor the best and then I'm gonna come over here next you'll find sliders for exposure temperature um, film color and grain you can click these to expose those and just speaking about the grain, this is the best film emulator I found that gives you really good movie quality grain. It looks really, really good. Uh, this is at one fourth quality right now, but if this was in um, full quality, you could just you could see how good it really looks. And finally, you have your drop down menus for the film emulator you want to convert to, and then the size of the um, film that you use. You have your Super 8, your 16 millimeter, and then 35 millimeter full frame. That's what I use for most of mine. And then I'm just going to convert this to a random. Um, two random film emulators just to show you guys the different looks you can get I like FJ valve for a lot of things it gives you that nice really like um, soft light look if um, I'm gonna go with this one just because I think it looks pretty cool so that's the FJ 8543 VD if you guys want to give this a little bit of a more personalized touch, what you can do is you can come over here and click on the color tab, and then you can just bring up these um, built-in um, Lumetri color panels that are in Premiere to begin with. So if you want to come over here, maybe give it a little bit of a colder look like that. Oh, I'll take that down a little bit. Or you can even give it a warmer look. Whatever you want to decide, you can just kind of mess with it, bump the saturation up a little bit. Um, I'll take the creative down. Um, curves, you can give it that kind of cinematic, uh, boost the lights, drop the darks, and that looks really good, so I'll keep it like that. And once you go over here and you change some of these Lumetri colors, if you come over here back into your Film Convert um, preset tab, you can see that this Lumetri color um, thing will be added to your effects panel, and you can change it right from the effects panel. Okay, so now let's talk about how you can get your hands on this for free. All you have to do is comment below on the video, give it a thumbs up, and then click the link in my description that says competition. Once you click that link, you can click the subscribe button and you'll get five entries. Once you do that and fill out your name and email, you get, you'll get some additional options for some extra entries so you have a better chance of winning. The program works for Premiere and After Effects, so just make sure you follow the download instructions included in the download fo folder. And if you win, I'll email you a link to where you can download it, so keep an eye on your email when the competition ends on February 25th. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Give it a thumbs up if you want more giveaways like this in the future or more tutorial videos in the future. I'm going to be bringing more vlogs also, so stay tuned for that, and I'll see you guys later.